Unbelievable. You told him it's a credible threat. I understand that. There are hundreds of lives at risk. I hope you're wrong about this, Jensen. So do I. Fine. Fine. Have your men pull back until I can talk to him myself. Miller out. Changing plans. Mac, you and your team will rendezvous with our London division. Secure the perimeter until I tell you to come back in. Jensen, you and I are on the roof. Is there a problem? Yeah. Approaching the target building now. Okay. Get your coat. You're gonna need it. Oh. I don't have to tell right. you what's happening. You know the drill. There are people down there. Radical, augmented people. Who've been sidelined by this world. And who think the only way to stop the oppression is by tearing down everything in their way. Their grievances may be just. Maybe they should be heard. But never on these terms. The world may be going to shit. But we're here to stand against the chaos. Every one of the guests down there are counting on us to keep them safe. Let's make sure we do. Yeah. Dr. Miller, I'm Nathaniel Brown. Thank you for agreeing to handle this discreetly. We didn't exactly have a choice. You threatened to invoke the Corporate Sovereignty Act. I gave your London division a full day to sweep for explosives. They found nothing. It's not just bombs we're concerned with. I've also replaced all the food and beverage brought in extra guards from Tarvis Security Services and ordered the men to work with your team when it arrives. Trust me, I'm taking this threat very seriously. Then why not cancel the event? This isn't the first time extremists have threatened to tear down the Safe Harbor Initiative. pro og supporters think we're profiting from their misery, promoting more failures like Gollum City. While anti og racists can't stand the thought of any augmented person living in peace, canceling this event will only embolden all of them. Hmm. The men planning to attack here tonight are no ordinary extremists. They murdered Talus Rucker, and they want to frame the Augmented Rights Coalition if their attack tonight succeeds. Is this true? How do you know it? How does it matter? We're here because of a credible threat against you and your Safe Harbor Convention. These men are out to stop you. They know you've been campaigning against the Human Restoration Act. They need it to pass. They don't care how many lives they destroy as long as that happens. But we do. It's Agent Jensen, isn't it? David Seraph told me about you. You might not believe this, Agent, yeah. but I'm also trying to save oh. lives tonight. The lives of your people. The several members of the UN Security Council are on my guest list tonight. I plan to convince them just how wrong the act really is. Alice Rucker couldn't stop it from passing, but I can. Where are you meeting then? In a secure conference room off the reception hall. Men from your London division have already cleared it. Doesn't matter. I want to see this room myself, and I want Agent Jensen here to coordinate with Tavos security, while the rest of my team re-examines the building. 
discreetly, of course. The head of our Tarvis division is Liam Slate. He's waiting for your man to join him in the Central Security Office. Go see him, Agent. And keep McCready and me in the loop. Mr. Brown, right. if you'll show me that yeah. conference room. Sure. Alex, I'm at the Apex Center. Brown's got members of the Security Council here tonight. Members sympathetic to our rights. You understand they must be protected at all costs. James? Were you eavesdropping on me? Uh, forgive me, but the situation what? did seem to merit it. Right. Well, if I need your advice tonight, I'll ask. The Illuminati already tried once to control human evolution. Having failed, it appears that some of them now are pushing for a complete eradication of your kind. We need to stop them. Brown and the people he's meeting with tonight may be the only ones who can. Adam, Janus is right. We'll see. Move away. <clears throat> Access to this part of the building is restricted. Security personnel only. Chief Slater's expecting me. Chief... Oh, right. He's, um, unavailable at the moment. Urgent matter. The urgent matter is why I'm here. Where is he? I'm sorry. Who did you say you were with? didn't. Look, I have an appointment to meet with Liam Stevens. Chief Liam Stevens. And I don't have a lot of time. Could you try him on the radio for me? I'll do better than that. You wait here, and I'll tell Stevens personally that you are here to see him, okay? Miller, McCready. Tarvis right. isn't letting me in. No, works just fine. The guard I spoke to. Uh, something's not right here. McCready, anyone from Tarvis Security contact you yet? Negative. Which is odd, actually. Shit. If the building's already compromised, where? Forget it. We stay on task. Jensen, get inside Slater's office and find out what's going on. Copy that. Max, send a team up for support right away. Already on the way. Area clear. So, uh, anybody catch the game last night? It was a real knockout.
All right. Now that's more like it. What's this? The mask that looks just like the ones worn by Marchenko's men inside the Garm facility. Only bloodier. What's that all about, I wonder? Oh. So that's where the real Tarvo security went. Um. Hello? <sighs> That's not good. Even more dead ta Tarvos. I keep I keep wanting to say Tavros, but that's not right. Tarvos. Slater Lester Dobbs is going to be installing new antivirus software on our network. He'll need the security override code if you wouldn't mind giving it to him. Told him to keep an eye out for a message from you. Mind taking care of this straight away? Um, five three five nine. Hello, Chief. You might have noticed a slight glitch in the security system. Looks like the switch trigger is part of our weekly bug killing expedition. But I will investigate to be sure. The system should be back online in a few minutes. Cheers. Right. So, that must be how they got in. Incredible. Just like that. Whole thing buggered. Hmm. Uh all right. Maybe another in another lifetime maybe, but not this one. Alright. Here we go. Uh five three five nine. My friends. There's been darkness in the world. Activate security override. But where there is darkness. There is also oh. opportunity, and we must seize it. We are the ones who can bring light back into the world. If we must, we will take up that torch, and we will make sure that all the augmented have a chance to live with dignity. I'd like to propose a toast. Miller, McCready, CCTV shows another compromised area. Back of the house. Looks like catering. I've got eyes on that area as well. It looks like our bogus Tarvos units are using a guarded security door to access the reception hall. Oh, fuck! They're everywhere, circulating among the guests. What are they playing at? Why aren't they fucking shooting yet? Jensen, any sign of Marchenko or the Orchid? Negative. Neither. Miller, can you get to Brown? I'm moving to him now. But Jensen, we need to know if the Orchid is in play. Get down here, circulate and find a key to that door. One of the guards must have it on him. Probably that. But it'd be easier if I knew how many guards I'm dealing with. I'll upload their patrol routes to your all red right. morgue. But we don't want all hell breaking loose down here. So take them down quietly. Mac, you rally with Jensen ASAP. I'll pick up Brown and get him safe. Good luck, man. Alright. Let's do this thing. Alright guys, I'm inside the reception hall. Got eyes on some of the guards, but there's no telling which one has the key card. Well, you'll find it soon enough, mate, because you need to take them all out. Can't have anyone in the weeds, yeah? And do it quietly. I'm close to your position now, I'll see you soon. No need to worry about security, sir. Alright. All right, man. If you say so. I got no reason to not believe you. <clears throat> so, uh, catch that game last night. All right. Just uh, find a nice, quiet spot. You should be dead, oh. Adam Jensen. Instead, you show up here with your comrades in tow, forcing me to adapt to the situation. We close the um. Hundreds of men, women, and children must be sacrificed. 
Because of your interference, I had to place explosives. Now hold on a minute. Residential towers across the way. I can send a detonation signal at any time. But if you come to the exhibition hall right now, only I won't have to. Talos Raka was a patient man, brother. But I am not. Eat. Come Don't have to do that. Now, agreed. The bombs. I heard. I don't know if I'll find him in time, but I'm already on it. Fucking hell. Marchenko's taking over the building. He's threatening to blow up the residential towers next door if I don't stop him. You do what you gotta do, man. But if the Orchid is in play, then his threat could be a smokescreen. The Delegate, our future, could be the real target here. You need to find and protect them. No one has to Where die. Did you? We can avoid another unnecessary tragedy. Isn't that what you said? You surrender now. I will give the kill switch to you. You'll spend the rest of your days in prison, but the hold your masters have on you will end. A nice dream. But we both know there is no escape from these men. I am a soldier, brother. I accept my fate. Then I'm sorry. There's only one way this ends. Mac, bomb threat is neutralized. So. First fucking good news I've heard all day. Are you getting anything from Miller? He was supposed to be with Brown and the delegates. Fuck. Oh. Orchid. I've got to find them. Jensen out. Low ping. Ah! Um. Reception hall. 
I tried to stop them, but I ended up here. Jim, I'm sorry. I... No, this isn't on you. Understand? You're a good agent. Wait. Save your strength. No. Listen. That's not what I wanted to say. What I mean to say is, you're a good man, Adam. Even, even when I doubted, I, oh, I always knew. Mac. Miller's dead. Bastards use the orchid. Christ. What about Brown and the delegates? I'll let you know when I find them. Hello? Delegates? Come on, come on, come on, let's go. Here we go. Me, that pocket secretary in Hong Kong. It went VIP long room, please. Ago, just long enough to shoot out a message. You intercepted it? Yeah, but it's cryptic. Looks like meeting in session. Proceed with delivery. Key 2202. As we consider the importance of this moment on a national Thanks. level, on a global level, on a humanitarian level. Nobody drink. The champagne's been poisoned. But don't drink the, the champagne. It's a cuvée de prestige. You and your guests need to get out of Apex Center now, Brown. Slater's dead. Tarvos is compromised. They've come to stop you. Can you get everyone to the helipad? Yes, yes, of course. My security team will escort us. But what about the other attendees? I'm afraid there have already been casualties, Brown. But I'm going after the people who did this. Then you have a long way to climb.
Monsanto CEO Nathaniel Brown took to the stage today to praise Interpol and Tarvis Security Services for thwarting what could have been a major terror attack during his safe harbor convention last week. Interpol has confirmed that a group of radical terrorists linked to the Augmented Rights Coalition wired the residential towers surrounding Apex Center with enough explosives to destroy two city blocks. As shocking as that fact turns out to be, Brown had only this controversial opinion to give. We must not make rash decisions based on fear, nor should we allow a vocal minority to dictate our future. The Human Restoration Act is a perversion of all the United Nations it stands for. In time, I believe saner minds on the Security Council will prevail. Strong words from a man with an even stronger bank account. Let us see if his prediction proves true. This is Eliza Hey, are you even listening to this? Why? We won! From Pike. Did we? <laughs> we completely disrupted their plan. Marchenko, the orchid, the bombs. They've been under too long, man. Time to come up for air. Take a breath. Janus messaged me last night, said Brown's been lobbying like a champ. He and the people you saved know the act isn't a solution. Picus will talk around it as long as they can, but that thing is finished. Janus always seems to have the inside track. Except when it really matters. Miller, right? I'm sorry, Adam. I really did think he was working for the Illuminati. For a while, we both did. By the time I realized he was innocent. We can't change the past. We have to keep going. What are you thinking? How many more plans do they have in motion? How many more soldiers like Marchenko are waiting for the call? <laughs> Don't call him a soldier. He was a thug, man. Soldiers have a code of honor. Soldiers follow orders, too. He was prepared to obey his, no matter the consequences. Sounds like you're sorry he's dead. He made his choice, I made mine. Regardless, we want the men behind him. Behind the Human Restoration Act. The ones still out there in the shadows. It's time for me to start pulling them into the light. Well, now we got names. Manderley and Page. The Collective won't stop until we bring these guys down. Yeah? Well, there's one more name I want to put a face to. Janus. So that's what you've been chewing on. Look, I'll try, Adam, but I already told you he doesn't like meetings that aren't on his terms. Then give him a choice. Either he sets up a meeting face to face, or I find him myself. I think it's high time we met the man behind the mask, Alex. Don't you? made the bombs that ripped through Ruzika train station earlier this week has been found dead in Prague. Authorities in the city tell me that an extensive investigation, conducted in part by members of Interpol, led them to the apartment of Alison Stanek, an ex-army demolition specialist who they believe may have been working with Ark. Police gained entry to Ms. Stanek's housing complex shortly after neighbors began complaining about power outages. They found the bodies of Stanek and dozens of augmented cultists inside, dead by apparent mass suicide. A coroner's report released in Prague today offers shocking new insight into the death of Dr. Talis Rucker, former leader of the Augmented Rights Coalition. Apparently, the primary cause of the doctor's death was the exceedingly high level of alcohol found in his system. No other toxins were present, nor were there signs of any suspicious activity. Sources close to Rucker tell me he had been struggling with alcoholism ever since becoming a public figure. I am sure I do not need to remind you folks that the organization he founded, the Augmented Rights Coalition, has been linked to last week's horrifying terror attack in London. It seems not so long ago that Dr. Talis Rucker was on this very program, trying to convince all of us that his Augmented Rights Coalition was a non-violent organization. Today, of course, we are all a little bit wiser. It did not take long for Ark to reveal its true colors once Dr. Rucker was dead. Since last week's attack, the United Nations has officially labeled Ark a terrorist organization. As we speak, brave state police officers in the Czech Republic are raiding Ark-controlled compounds inside the Udalek complex. 
We can only imagine what instruments of terror they will find. The Diwali criminal organization is under intense scrutiny this evening for their role in the London attack. Evidence uncovered by Interpol indicates that high-ranking members of the chapter in Prague supplied weapons and logistical support to ARC terrorists. Among those being sought for questioning is Otar Botkaveli, leader of the Diwali's Prague chapter. Sources close to Botkaveli tell me he has only recently assumed this role and should not be held accountable for past mistakes. I do not know, folks. Is this really the face of a man we can trust? Join the online discussion and let us know what you think. News out of Paris today, where a sharp rise in illegal underground publications may have links to a prison escape recently orchestrated in Prague. Last week, Czech state police were holding members of the underground news group Samostat on charges of disturbing the peace, human trafficking, and media terrorism. The radicals escaped their holding cell, however, and are believed to have subsequently made their way deeper into Western Europe. Shortly after their escape, a radical publication called Silhouette began appearing throughout France. Has Samistat rebranded itself as Silhouette? I am sure you will agree with me on this one, folks, no matter what name these people go by. There is nothing more dangerous than the spread of false news. Turning our attention now to a more colorful story. A recent incident inside an illegal underground drug laboratory has led authorities to the heart of Prague's neon operation. According to sources familiar with the new drug, the dangers of neon had more to do with illegal distribution methods and criminal ties than with consuming the drug itself. Make no mistake, folks, neon is illegal, and the dismantling of this laboratory is good news for everyone. However, some government officials have hinted to me that the drug may have therapeutic benefits, and if so, a government-approved version of Neon could be made available to the public eventually. Further testing will be required, of course, so only time will tell. That is not the point! We should have all been informed! That is why we are here now! Volkart, what's done is done. The broad strokes of the operation were very clear and haven't changed. There are always adjustments that will occur in the field. You should know that. Adjustments? Those were not mere adjustments. Interpol was more capable than we anticipated. They have a new augmented agent by the name of... Adam Jensen. Who we believe may have had external help. Possibly by the Juggernaut Collective, or even Janus directly. We're looking into it, but we... All that is speculation at this point. Let's find out more and reconvene later this week. Thank you, everyone. That'll be all. It's your own fault. I'm aware of that, Doctor. Elizabeth sends her regards. Hmm. Report. Overall, the subject seems quite well adjusted despite the massive traumas he's experienced, and his memories are still consistent with the program. He is remarkably stable. Excellent. How close is he to contact with Janus? Very. And it's only a matter of time.